Hi, my name is Tony, and this is My Life in San Diego. And this is why I moved to San Diego, because I love rain. Yes. I absolutely cannot stand sunshine. The cart lady. Oh. She's the cart lady who yelled, who used to yell at Tira at the hotel, motel. Right. It's a hotel. Okay. And she used to yell at her about not getting her, her room. Her room. Yeah, twenty one dollars or whatever. Yeah, and but yeah, she's the cart lady of Vista. She like walks around the cart. She dresses like a weirdo because she's the cart lady. But she always has a fat stack of cash. Like, what is she doing to get that cash? She's like, got a. She's a drug hustler. She's a hooker. Ah, you dick. Jeez, I didn't think you were supposed to go in there. Whatever. We almost died. I saved this. Well, it's, what's really funny is that's the entrance I always use. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> the noble. And we have arrived. Oh! Oh, I gotta go to the DVD section. There's one. This is a French movie that I want to buy that I have yet to finish watching. Oh, I, you were I actually kind of hate Barnes & Noble. Mm -hmm. Very, Very long, long engagement. Hey, they have a... Woo, oh. The American version. Do they? Yeah, it was redone by two assholes. <laughs> Paris 36. And the movie that I went in for... The class. The guy who is... He's actually the teacher right here. Mm -hmm. This is a story, the movie's based upon this guy right here. That's the actual guy. Oh, that is so he plays himself in the movie. Really? Yes. Awesome. And then Tira spotted this book, World War II Stats and Facts. It doesn't look like Seattle out here. What do you have against people who are pregnant? They're overpopulated in this world with their kids. I want a bike. Oh, here we go. Uh, it's blue. These are like kids. Excite bikes. Shit. Where's the cruisers? Those cruisers? Kinda. Oh, there we go. I don't know how much this one is. It's a Schwinn. $119. Oh my god. Schwinn's are supposed to be good, right? I guess so. That's a cool bike. Why is there a question mark upside down and then a question mark normal side? Section that says automotive. Not back there. Are you sure? Oh, yeah. Huh. She's looking for armor rolls. Oh, they're right here. Armor roll wipes. Well, what you're looking for... Inside the car and the window. Like, the inside window always gets like... It looks like... You get get a pack of these. Mm -hmm. Those are great for cleaning windows. Yes. It's coastal breeze. I've been living by the coast. I want to make sure. You, know. you can open your window. Yes, I guess I could do that, huh? It's my new backpack for next semester. Awesome. Oh, and it's got a little cart too, so I could be that that guy. You know, with my Spider-Man backpack. You know, if I had the balls, I would totally rock one, but I don't. Practicing for the well, I just got a call from my insurance company, and they said my car is in going into paint right now, and it's looking like it'll be ready come Friday, and they're going to call me, I guess, Friday to let me know when I can come pick it up. And I'll tell you, I'm I'm damn excited to go pick up my car uh, because I just really miss my car. I, you know what? And I, you know, it's just, well, I guess it's like a. It's like that thing, you know, they always say that, uh, you know, absence makes the heart grow fonder. I know that applies for love and people, but um, now that I haven't had my car, I really miss it. I want to shift. I, I found myself during the weekend, I didn't, I forgot to mention this, like a couple times I went to go, like with my left foot, go for the clutch that's not there. And a couple times I went right down here for the uh, e-brake that's not there because it's down over there on the bottom my left foot. So, uh, just sort of the idiosyncrasies of the cars are, are like, you know, so used to doing it one way. So, it'll be nice. I rode in my sister's car today. She has a 2009, 2000, yeah, 2009 Toyota Corolla. And, uh, and it totally made me miss my car because like the mirror, I was sitting in the passenger seat, the mirror was like right there. <laughs>
It's like, oh, come on, I want my car back. Right now, I'm heading to In-N-Out. I'm hungry and uh, I feel like a cheeseburger today because I need something Californian, California in me because, um, yeah, that's what she said. It's been rainy all day today and it's just, I need to like taste sunshine, if that makes sense. If it doesn't, then you don't you don't know what in and out Burger is. It's it's a burger of sunshine. And a shake. Oh, good God, we're getting a shake. It's kind of like the Golden Arches, just, it's a golden arrow. You know, of all things, I'll have to admit that the Charger does have a, quite an aggressive little stance. You just saw it in the reflection over there in the glass. It's quite an aggressive looking car. And it is aggressively eating up my money. You know, I have a hard time saying no to a set of pretty eyes. And um, case in point is I got myself a double-double over here. I've got a shake and a soda. And I'll probably just drink a little bit of soda because I really want the shake. And the girl, this girl Jennifer, who works over at In-N-Out, I saw her name tag, she asked me if I wanted a drink carrier. And I was like, sure. I don't need a drink carrier. I was like two, so I got a drink carrier. <laughs> so anyways, I'm, I'm heading to my mom's house. She wants me to take a look at some of this paint over her cupboards. And she painted one of the doors, I guess. And so, um, she wants me to, she wants me to prove it or something. I don't know, sure. But um, it doesn't matter. Every time she's asked me to do that, she doesn't like my criticism or my critique of the paint color. Well, here's the cabinets paint my mom picked out. I like it. Looks good. It's Tony approved. <gasps> get big buggies. Go get big buggies. Go get big buggies. Go get big buggies. Big buggies, go get them. The pool is in full swing even though it's some piss-ass weather. My mom is sleeping while watching Kathy Griffin. Hey, what's up, guys? I just got done having a little bit of fun with my camera and taking a bunch of weird pictures and uh, I'll post them up on my Facebook account. I just kind of had a little fun with that. I think I'm gonna call it expressions or something like that, I don't know. Today was a good day for America, for everything. <laughs> so today was a good day, I did a little goofing off earlier today and, uh, and I knuckled down and finished up the, um, the last card from the wedding and uh, I'm gonna keep this short. So my question for you today is, do you believe in ghosts? And I ask that because I have a few ghost stories to tell. And I think I'm gonna tell them over the next couple of days. Um, probably not at night though, cause it'll freak me out to tell these stories at night, especially here. <laughs> cause I got a couple of ghost stories here. And uh, oh, and one from my parents' Temecula house. So if I can find the video that accompanies this one of the stories and photos, I'll see about posting photos, see if how I can drag and drop photos in here, so. Anyways, uh, I'll spook you guys out tomorrow night. I'll start that tomorrow night. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna sack out. It's like two o'clock in the morning and I'm just tired. So anyways, you guys have a nice night and I'll talk to you again tomorrow. So there was this guy who was, uh, his, his gamer tag was only use me shoddy two. And I think I guess you could say that's a compliment to only use me blade. So if you've got people copying you, I guess that's the highest form of flattery. So it, originality is going out the window, I guess. So yeah, so this guy only, only used me shoddy too. Was using those auto shotguns that like I don't know, maniac is running around. I hate shotguns in that game. Everyone complains about grenade launchers and nobody ever bitches about shotguns like I don't I think it's funny like noob tubes noob tubes I think that shotguns in modern warfare 2 are probably the biggest noob weapon ever because it doesn't take any skill you point you pull the trigger and it destroys whatever target you know with a grenade launcher if you miss like you, you shoot one into a room and you miss you might get a hit marker but you might not get a kill. I have to be honest. I don't use Danger Close. I don't use Commando Pro because I have integrity. Hey, what's up?